Do you have a hog in your throat? I had a little buggy. A frog in your throat? No, a hog. Oh. I thought she had a frog in her throat because she was like, she was trying to like lick one of those weird frogs again. I love those. To get that reaction. And she might have swallowed one. You're so weird. You ever the video where we were like really stoned? That's like half of that. Oh! I was eating character stone! Anyway, we got a letter from the Grim Reaper 666 who is really pissed off. Never piss off a guy who puts rape in his screen name. Grim Reaper 666. I, I am very scared of this man. He goes to Cleveland State Community College because they take anybody from the community. Isn't that the home of the Cougars? It is. Yeah, the home of the Cougars. And they're, which is really just the. The school nickname is also the cheerleading squad. The so does that mean that, they're, that their cheerleaders are a bunch of 45-year-old horny women? That's exactly right. The 45-year-old women who hit on all the 18-year-old basketball players. Where the fuck was I? You can't play basketball. What? I got mad hops, yo. Yeah, they don't allow people to run around with the pogo penis hitting the floor. See? Check out the extension. If I want to block a shot, I'll just be like... The only problem is, folks, the only looks at that on camera, the bottom line, he is no taller than 6'4 or 5. I'm like 7, 12 inches tall? And then my pogo penis is another 2 feet. You're, so, you're shorter than Spud Webb. So? I got mad hops, yo, look. You can't play basketball. Your arms don't work. You can't dribble, and you have to be a point guard. What's your point? I want to fuck some cougars. When I was 18, if I had a 45-year-old woman who was like, give me that dick, I'd be like, sure, I'd be happy to. Would you like fries with that? Because I would have been working at McDonald's or Burger King at the time. Yeah, what were the middle-aged hot women when we were young? Yeah, all these trends. And I'm sorry to get off topic, Grim Reaper, to just summarize... Uh, yeah, if you need cigarettes to get through the day, then you probably want to take up masturbating. Um, so anyway, let's talk about cougars. Yes. That's pretty much a good thing. Where was I when they were, like, hitting on all the young kids? I mean, now I'm having sex with, with, like, people who are, like, the age of cougars. But, like, they're my age. It doesn't really count. And they're, therefore, they're not really cougars. Yeah. It's like, I didn't have the young barrel cock like I did back then. Back then, if I saw, like, an old woman, like, middle-aged hot woman, I'd be like, ah, she's too old for me. And I was like, hey, little one, come over here and lift my pussy. Yeah. I do that like a 70-year-old. That's like the equivalent of a cougar to somebody our age, mid-30s. Is there any, is there such thing as a hot 70-year-old? Yes. Give me one example. Raquel Welch. She's hot? Maybe. I don't know. Um, Sophia Loren. Pardon me if I don't know how old you really are, Sophia. Um, <clears throat> Betty White. Oh, yeah. I would fuck her in her goat ass. A goat ass? Yes. <laughs> why, are you, why are you having sex with her pet? Because her ass is too old and wrinkly. <laughs> so I'd fuck her goat's ass instead. Awesome. Rue McClanahan. You ever Blanche from Golden Girl? I think she's dead. So? I would <laughs> fuck the no crap out of it. Really? Oh, it's just B. Arthur and the other one who's dead. It's still no, Betty White's still alive. B. Arthur's still dead. Betty's dead. No, B. B. Arthur is dead. Yes. Arthur died. Betty White's still alive. And Betty, whatever her name was. Betty White's alive, yeah, right? It's still no. Getty. The other one! I would have sex with Estelle Getty. She's too weird looking. Yeah, she kind of looks like Kermit the Frog. That's going to be Arthur being dead now. She's up in heaven somewhere, and people are still getting her confused with George Washington. Absolutely. So um, other old women. I think when, like, Beyonce's 70, I'm going to chew her ass like chewing gum, because it's going to be all wrinkly like a piece of chewing gum. <laughs> chew chewing gum. She's married like you are. She's married to Dwight Gooden, right? What? Jay Z, they're the same person. What? They look exactly the same. No, they don't. All of you at home, I want you to go on like Google Pictures and get a photo of Dwight Gooden and then get a photo of Jay Z and 
tell them apart, because I sure as fuck can't. What? You don't agree with me? You know what else I can't t- tell apart? Characters from Planet of the Apes and Patrick Ewing! I'm offended by that comment. So am I. I'm leaving. Dr. Zayas, eat my asshole. <laughs>